Hi everyone, welcome back to the channel and my midweek video where I'm going to talk about a bit about the channel. Um, just going to continue doing this every once a week, just going through the channel, upcoming videos, just talking in general, just a little general chat, just to let people engage a bit more, dropping comments below. So this is the first one. From now on I'm going to try and do these every Wednesday um, and then upload them around about lunchtime and then obviously just for engagement purposes and they're going to be about a five minute video each time obviously this one's going to be a little bit more because I'm just sort of explaining what I'm going to do so before we get into it I'm just going to say thank you for everyone that's subscribed so far to the channel thank you for the engagement everyone that's liked the channel it's really really just yeah I'm just really humble about it because it's just such a great thing to see the amount of likes I'm getting the amount of comments the followers are growing all the time you know it's really great stuff so you notice my son is in the back he's having a little nap so I just thought, oh, yeah, I'll grab the camera and start filming a bit of this sort of vlog, sort of chat video that I'm going to go forward with. Um, so you would have seen that I've done a poll in the channel uh, just to sort of see what people thought. And most of the people said, yep, they'd be happy with this sort of video. So it's just more for me just to update people on the channel, update people with any issues ongoing and stuff like that. So the main topic this week for the channel is around my car. So am I still saying it? I'm going to talk about car insurances because they are gone crazy and a little bit of upcoming videos on the channel. So the first thing is, am I still selling my car? Well, you may be happy to know any BMW fans that I am actually going to be keeping my car for a bit longer. So after all the crazy prices I was giving them for my car, you know, crazy quotes of like 21 and then I had uh, phone calls from other dealers offering me under 21 now because they reckon my car has dropped £800 in the space of a week. So the used car market at the moment is crazy. It's definitely not worth selling your car at the moment. Trust me, it's just not worth it. My car is in fantastic condition, full BMW services. It's got the full, like everything on it. When I spoke to the dealers, they said it doesn't matter if you've got BMW services. It doesn't matter the condition of the car. This is what the price is and that's it. And I'm thinking, the amount of you know money I've spent on this car, it's got Bridgestone tires all around, you know, full BMW service history. It's detailed all the time. It's you know it's ceramic coated. I mean it's looked after to the max. It's garage. It does low mileage. Only cover about 200 miles a month, so maybe 300 at most. So hardly any miles on this car. And the prices I was be given for this car is so so low. It's really frustrating. So yes, I'm going to be keeping my car for a bit longer. Um, obviously the size of this car is getting a bit small for a growing family, but we're going to have to make do for now. I'm going to have to get this car serviced again in April so I'm just gonna have to pay out for it and just keep this car for a bit longer it's a great car nothing wrong with it so that's the plan so on to car insurances now so my car insurance on this one is due on the 28th of December so I had my renewal through so at the moment I'm paying uh, I think it was 730 pound last year worked out about I think it was like 60 cent pound a month yeah whatever it was yeah so not bad performance car 33 years old got 12 years no claims and you know I've got one thing on my insurance where a tree fell on my car so that still goes against me that happened three years ago so that puts my insurance a little bit higher but this car is a group like 38 something like that so pretty good price not bad I thought yes yeah, fine Hastings Direct come to me and said my new price for this year will be £2,280 where the hell are they getting the price increase from so I phoned them up and they said Yep, it's the to do with electric vehicles. Um, there's been a lot of insurance claims on electric vehicles, and it's bringing up the prices to make them higher on every other person's car. Um, so yeah, so electric cars are causing insurance problems for other cars. Apparently, that's what they told me. Um, I looked a little bit into that, and apparently, it is true that insurance on well, some insurance companies won't even insure electric vehicles anymore because of the risk of fires and stuff, um, and they won't insure them to be in garages. Apparently, so there you go. So you've got to think my car is insured for social only. I only cover 4,000 miles a year. It's garaged, in a lot garage. So insurance is should be cheap. Don't commute in it or anything. And they're saying £2,280. Phoned them up and they said to me, the best we can do it is £1,400. So obviously I shopped around online. I found it with Admiral for, I think it was £1,000. Well, it came up at £1,000 at first, but I managed to change something because some reason on my compare thing i had it as part on the drive but i park it in the get I, I lock it in the garage now so it's locked away and that brought it down to like 925 pound which worked out about 88 pound a month something like that so 
okay, it's gone up, and I, expect, I expected it to go up because all car insurance are going up. But I was happy to pay a little bit more, like £200 more, okay, I can live with that. But not like £1,800 more, whatever it's going to be. It's just going to be some crazy, crazy price. So, yeah, insurances at the moment are going up, so it's just something to be aware of. And maybe that's why a lot of these cars are on the market now, because people can't afford to insure them. And that's why there's a lot of these on the market and the price of these are dropping. Could be another reason for it. But I'm told by my insurance company that it was to do with electric vehicles and I have done a bit of research on it and that is the case. Finally, we go on to future content for the channel. So we're in December now and you would have just seen my product of the year review video. So if you haven't seen that yet, go and check that out because that's a really good video and it just shows you some of the products that I've been using for this year that I really recommend. So yeah, go and check that video out. And then after that, we've got a impact wrench review video unboxing video so if you're into your cars and you know working on your cars go and check that video out next and then i'm going to be doing a video on this car which will be five things that annoy me about this car because obviously i've done a video regarding what i love about this car and is a you know everything's really been good on this car and i do love it a lot but there's always some things that you find annoying so that's the video for that and then we go in to the christmas special on the 24th of december you want to make sure you watch this one because I had a lot of fun making it and it's a great video. So definitely check this out when it comes on because it will give you a bit of a smile on your face. And that's what it's all about. This video is about putting a smile on your face, ready for Christmas and having a bit of fun when we're detailing our cars. And, you know, it's got to be fun. So that's the future videos coming up. I may have a little break after Christmas through the new year just to chill with family um, take in the Christmas time in the new year. And then when I come back in the new year, I'll think of some new content to create obviously we're going to keep doing these sort of videos just sort of little updates little problems that i have with my car or anything like that i'm just ongoing things i'm going to chat to you happy for people to engage in the comments and obviously drop me a comment below if you've had problems with your insurance or you know you're selling your car and stuff like that it's really good to engage really good to keep the channel engaging for everyone that's watching and keep content coming for people to watch even if it's not your sort of video it's just good to have a chat now and then it's just good for people's mental well-being and good for you know, people to see what is actually going on in the real life with myself and people you can reach out and talk to me and happy to chat anytime if you want to drop me a message on Instagram or YouTube. Always here for a chat for anyone that needs a little bit of a talk or, you know, you just need that moment to talk to someone that you want to let something out. Feel free to jump jump on the comments and drop me a comment or drop me a message on Instagram. Always happy to have a chat with any of you. So yeah, going forward, I'm going to try to keep these videos to about five minutes long. Obviously, this one's a bit longer because it's obviously um, the first time doing it. And I just want to chat a little bit about that. So hopefully I haven't bored you too much. And if you've stayed around to this point, thank you very much. And I'm glad you enjoyed the video. And if you haven't already, please subscribe to the channel. And if you could, please like this video because it just helps me grow the channel more. It helps push out my videos more in YouTube if more people are liking the video. That's how the algorithm works. If you like in the video you engage on the video just pushes out the channel more and my other videos will get picked up and hopefully get more views going forward and i can make bigger better content for all of you thank you for watching and i'll see you on the next video which is coming up this sunday so take care guys and i'll see you then